Welcome back to another Arizona Insider video. In this video, we're gonna take you to one of Arizona's hidden gems, Greer, Arizona. With Greer sitting at 8,300 feet of elevation, it's a great place to escape the Phoenix heat, and it's a very popular destination for families with a bunch of activities to do in the summertime. So stick around as we go check out Greer, Arizona. If this is your first time to the channel, we're all about living in Arizona and showing you what that's like from our native's perspective. So if you're looking to see and learn more about living in Arizona, make sure to hit that subscribe button and like this video. Now hitting that like button, you guys really helps us share these videos with other people just like yourself. So now that that's out of the way, rear Arizona. Like I mentioned, Greer sits at 8,300 feet of elevation, so in the summertime you'll be out of the Phoenix heat and you'll be able to enjoy all the outdoor summer activities Greer has to offer. Some of the more popular things to do are hiking some of the 16 different trails in Greer, fishing, biking, wildlife viewing, stargazing, and seeing the colors of fall that you don't get to see in Phoenix. Bucks. We'll self-remote for a while. We're uh, hiking the crick, the crick in Greer. In this video, my family and I did a little day trip where we did a light hike and had lunch at one of Greer's more popular restaurants, Molly Butler's. We hiked along the Little Colorado River, which originates right here in Greer. The Little Colorado River will travel roughly 160 miles where it will eventually meet up with the eastern end of the Grand Canyon. So we are here in Greer, Arizona. I don't know what to tell you distance wise, but we're a good four, <coughs> four hours from Phoenix in about 35, 40 minutes uh, east of Pine Top Lakeside. Breathing hard right now, but Greer's a really cool little small, <coughs> excuse me, small town. Uh, its own little small town, kind of tucked in almost like a valley back here. Um, and we're kind of in the back of the neighborhood, kind of lightly hiking by this creek. Uh, but if you're looking for a really like sec secluded place to come, uh, rent a lodge, rent a cabin, Greer might be the spot for you. Now there are two very popular restaurant destinations in Greer, The Rendezvous and Molly Butler's. For more information about both of these, check the description down below. In today's video, we chose Molly Butler's, which dates back to the late 1800s where the lodge was originally built. And then about 30 years later, in 1910, Molly Butler started serving food to people passing by on horseback. So if you're looking for a quaint place to eat with breathtaking views and a taste of that mountain life, Molly Butler's is your place. Now remember, don't forget to check out the Rendezvous restaurant just down the street where they have some of the best pie in the White Mountains. 